temple space. Possible to share that spot and let them build a temple and still have a mosque. There's quite a bit of space on the actual Temple Mount, and and the two mosques are there. But I don't think those extremists do not want to share. Um, I don't. I I would, you know, that would be something where the 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 Muslim scholars of that area would have to um, see what arrangements could be made. I mean, you know, Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. I'm just saw a video of Hamza Yusuf of California with regard to Al-Masjid Al-Aqsa being asked whether there is a, a possibility of having a Jewish temple on uh, the Al-Haram Al-Sharif and it's referred to as Al-Haram Al-Sharif because of Salah al-Din al not the technical Al-Haram and he responds that Al-Aqsa, the ulama of uh, Al-Quds Al-Sharif should uh, discuss whether there is some kind of concession to build a Jewish temple and he mentions two masajid. Now your ignorance is showing the entire complex is Al-Masjid Al-Aqsa. The entire Al-Haram Al-Sharif, the entire Al-Aqsa complex is Al-Masjid Al-Aqsa. The masjid going towards the Qibla direction is referred to as Al-Qibali constructed by Sayyiduna Umar radiallahu an, and the other masjid, the Gold Dome Masjid is the masjid known as Dome of the Rock. That is the, the former Qibla of Bani Israel when they were Muslims. So your compounded ignorance, not only in politics, but also in the deen of Allah is not the first time. Do not ever give a suggestion that a Jewish temple can be constructed on Al-Aqsa complex. It's totally impermissible in Sharia. There can never be a church or a temple, and you refer to it as a temple mount, you ignoramus. It's not a temple mount. It's Al-Aqsa al-Sharif. So learn the deen of Allah before you start preaching rubbish and saying such type of incendiary statements.